Hello and welcome to the second instalment of our Student Insights series, where we are speaking to people to find out what it's like to work in the Salesforce ecosystem. My name is Holly Suffield and I am the Senior Manager for Partner Talent Programs here at Salesforce. And today I'm joined by Ben Murray, the Chief Marketing Officer at CloudShift, who are a Platinum Salesforce partner. And we are also joined by Becky Murray and Ben Vos, who are recent interns at CloudShift. Uh, CloudShift are a Platinum Salesforce consulting partner and we were set up in 2015. Uh, we were set up by customers of Salesforce actually, which gives us a really good unique background and a really good customer centricity approach. Um, since then we've grown to almost 100 people um, and we've got a really good team of people on board that are you know, multi-cloud experts across all of the solutions that Salesforce offers. I think the, the first thing which we did to set it up was actually just working out um, the learning path which they needed to go on um, using Trailhead. Um, so we created that learning path for both of them um, that was specifically relevant for the role which they were going to be doing. Um, and you know, we got uh, people from within both the teams with Becky and Ben were going to be in to contribute their ideas in terms of the, the tasks which they could contribute value to quite quickly um, and how they could upskill skill themselves quickly as well. Um, and I think, you know, from our point of view, it was, it was great to have an extra pair of hands um, within both the teams which they operated in. Um, and we found it really valuable. I and mean, certainly, um, for example, the work which Becky did within the marketing area was invaluable. Um, you know, obviously 2020 was somewhat of a challenging year for a lot of people uh, and Becky was fantastic in terms of helping with our internal comms just really helping to make sure that we were communicating to our staff uh, we were helping them with their welfare um, and you know it was it was a massive benefit for us to be able to help support staff um, you know more than we would have if, if she wasn't available um, so that was definitely a big benefit to the business um, and I think that you know these the interns that we've got on this we don't we don't set up an internship just thinking that they're going to come in for two or three months and they're going to disappear and not contribute value to the Salesforce ecosystem. You know, I think hopefully what we've got here is, you know, the next generation of, you know, the budding enthusiasts of Salesforce in the ecosystem. Um, so I think, you know, hopefully they'll be coming back and doing more work for us in the future. Hopefully they will. I chose to intern with CloudShift because I studied business at A-level, um, which I really enjoyed. Um, and then this encouraged me to take a degree in business management um, at university. So the internship gave me some practical experience um, in business, uh, which I could use for my further studies. Um, and then my family have been working with Salesforce for a number of years. Um, so I've been hearing lots of exciting things about the ecosystem um, and learning a bit about the dynamics of the organization. So I was, I was quite eager to learn more. So I was uh, preparing for a third year placement that I have in my degree as I'm taking a sandwich course. So I was just looking to broaden my horizons and just looked down different avenues. So I knew where to apply in the third year and CloudShift was a very vibrant and agile company which basically fitted everything I was looking for. So I just wanted to learn more about Salesforce as well and they gave me this opportunity over the summer, which was perfect. I focus more on internal marketing projects. Um, so for example, I help with staff welfare initiatives. So I did um, Wellness Wednesday emails um, out to the whole of CloudShift about you know healthy eating or exercise. Um, and then weekly I manage the internal emails um, via Pardot. So I got a bit of experience with Pardot, um, which is really helpful. Um, I also ran quiz nights to bring everyone together. Um, and I actually also did some um, external projects, some help on the external projects. Um, so I did some work for the annual CloudShift Property Summit, um, which was hosted virtually for the first time. Um, so it was important to have a big um, group of us to make it successful. I initially was involved with solutions. So I worked alongside the solutions team, uh, shadowing them on prospective clients and also current client calls where then we'd go on to I'd support the team in a variety of tasks such as proofreading SOWs which was very interesting because it gave me an overall, overall picture of the actual projects and how project scope worked and then after that I then moved on to the delivery team where I basically worked in two major projects at the time where they were bidding so I was working 
on those projects, helping on calls and also the tasks on user stories and helping to implement parts of Salesforce, which is really interesting because that's not what I initially had signed up for, but they gave me the opportunity to move into that part. And then that, yeah, that was really interesting as it also then led me to take a Salesforce credential at the end, which was perfect for just developing as a Salesforce worker, which is really good. My admin 201 at the end of uh, the summer period, and now I'm working towards my Tableau. So my Tableau credential at the moment, so that will be hopefully my next one, which is interesting. I think it was mainly I learned how to best operate in a virtual business environment, um, which is obviously not the norm. But um, I learned that communication was key, um, you know, to communicate points, um, meet new people, just messaging um, people to get to know them was really important. Um, and most significantly, it's given me a deeper insight into how different organisations operate. Um, and that's a key aspect of my uh, learn of my studies for my degree. Um, I think it was just learning about how a large organisation actually works, seeing as this is one of my first experiences in such a big organisation. It was really interesting to see how they communicate with customers as well, as I'd never worked on this sort of like environment before. And then, yeah, I think that was really, really like, valuable to me. And then also giving me the opportunity to take my credentials and push forward that way. And upskilling me was really, like really valuable to me and then also the other like webinars that Salesforce provide were really interesting just to gain more knowledge about different products that they had available at the time because we had the service Klaus Voice came out in summer so listening to that was just really interesting just to gain more knowledge about all that Salesforce are doing. I learned lots of things about the culture of Salesforce um, and I learned well I was really interested in the pledge one percent um, which I thought was a great initiative, um, popped up a lot um, in the marketing campaigns. Um, and I also enjoyed learning about the diversity and inclusivity um, that Salesforce promotes. I just say to put yourself out there. Um, it's a great opportunity, so um, take it. Um, definitely reach out to meet new people because, you know, there's so many people that have had different experiences they know different things like you can gain so much knowledge just from having a chat to someone um so basically yeah just to be proactive um do as much you know chatting as you can do um and yeah really throw yourself um into it i was aware of trailhead but i never actually started using it until they created a path for me which guided me through the uh, ranger course just the path to ranger so I've still got a few more to do till I reach that threshold. But yeah, that path was really good to just help you, guiding you through to just becoming more knowledgeable at the whole Salesforce community and also how to use the platform. Because when I arrived, I wasn't aware of these different aspects. I just thought it was a sales CRM. So it was just really interesting just to gain the knowledge about all the different partners, partners they've got. So yeah, that was really good about Trailhead that I found. It was also really engaging. I'm not 100% sure um, what I want to do uh, in the future, but obviously I've really, really enjoyed my marketing internship um, and studying business at university. I think I probably will end up going into business, um, but I'm definitely still interested in doing work for CloudShift during the um, holiday periods because I feel there's just so much more to learn, uh, so much stuff I don't know about. Um, I'm also keeping my eyes on any exciting developments with Salesforce. So when I come back for holiday periods, I'm up to date. Um, but yeah, I can't say yet what I want to do in the future, but I'm just trying a bit of everything. At the moment, I'm not too sure as there's just so much on offer, especially within Salesforce, but I am trying to just keep on top of the releases and hopefully just progress as much as I can in, over the course of my degree and then hopefully maybe look at something related to Salesforce in my placement year.